Right, hello. Time to play a beat em up game. By myself. I know this game has online, but I'm just playing. I'm, I, I do the solo gameplay. That's where it's at on this stream. I wanted to play this game. I heard it's quite good. That's, this was one of the other games I was alluding to uh, as wanting to play. Told you guys I wanted to play a couple games casually over the next few days while I have some time on my hands. This was one of them. So, let's get started, shall we? There's no reason to... Oh, look, intro. I find it very funny that this is, like, the oldest style of animated turtles, by the way. Because I, I, I'm going to make people in the chat feel real old right now. This style of Ninja Turtles generally predates, like, me. As a person. Because the one I'm the most familiar with, and still not really that familiar with, I was never that into TMNT, is, uh, like, the, the 2000s era one. The one where they're, like, taller, and all the games were terrible. <laughs> like, this is the reason it never stuck around, is that all the, all the, uh, the, the accompanying tie-in games, uh, for that era of TMNT were Shan. They weren't very good, were they? <laughs> but, uh, the 90s style has- the 90s style of Ninja Turtles has survived pretty much exclusively on the merit of that one Konami game that people liked. Story mode. New game. Chill, okay, and gnarly. These are our difficulty settings. Chill, okay. I'm gonna be. I'll be. Oh, I'm an okay gamer. How old am I? I'm in my mid 20s. I'm being vague. Vague gamer. Backflip, flying attack. So circles like our dodge. I'm okay. You know, I, no one needs a tutorial anyway. Is that Konami game terrible? What, a Konami arcade game? No, it was great. People love the Konami arcade game. Ah, character selection. Leonardo. Michelangelo. He has no range. The range is so poor, but speed. I'm, my webcam is once again obscuring the character. So I'm going over here. I'm over here now. Again, it, it, Rahel has poor range. I do not like poor range. But I also do not like to have the bad speed. I can't see what April's stats are because they blend into the fucking background. Weak power. We pick a balanced character. I pick a balanced character. Balanced stats. Balance in all things, you know what I'm saying? Do I have to? Oh, it goes automatically, right. The game might be a touch quiet. Uh, how do I resolve this? I feel a need to turn this up. I think I made it a bit quiet. <laughs> do the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles eat pineapple pizza? I don't know, man. Also, hi everyone, welcome to the stream. I didn't, I didn't say hi, I just started playing a game. I never do. Do I ever actually like bother to say hi before I start playing the game? I don't think I ever do. It's still like Nurse Cat, Zonu, Kaze, Ed Weirdo, Straka, Al Serino, Andrea. Welcome to the stream. Hello, hello. Adagvi, hello, hello. We gotta get to channel 6. All good beat em ups take place in a news studio. This is fact, this is known. Because the Simpsons arcade game's got one of those too. I'm testing the controls. <laughs> I failed a challenge immediately. Fail to. <laughs> That's a real fucking mean thing to stick in the first level, isn't it? Like, the first thing you're gonna do is, I mean, you fail a challenge! You got hit! Idiot! <laughs> Why 
why would you put that in the first fucking level? I mean, I guess it's the easiest place to put a challenge like that, but like, so it's the first thing a player sees? Oh, he does a super move! They're gaming! Dude, I could be gaming. I did it. I defeated 15 foot soldiers. Nothing bad will happen if I... I found burn. I'm sure that means something to someone, but not much to me, let me tell you. Fuck. Oh, you can ukemi. Crazy. Jab, jab. Deep Fuck, I tried to taunt and was punished for my hubris accordingly. Hiya. They got the meats! <laughs> nah, I got him. Now I wanna go. Uh, Throw this guy. Do a Tatsu, bro. I'm trying. I'm trying quarter circle back motions. It's no. I don't think. I don't think quarter circle was a thing in this game. Oh man, the reactions. What a gamer. You know, I'm racking up stacks here. Ah, oh, he fucking hit me with his sword, mate. That's crazy. Go! Oh, that was that wasn't the move. That was the move. That was the kind of move we're looking for. Get that get that projectile type beat, you know? Ah, oh, I've, I've, my power has increased. I've gained extra HP. I know this game had RPG elements, actually. Oh, baby, what a dodge roll. I like the addition of a dodge roll. Most, like, why do beat-em-up games never have a dodge roll? Classic headline. What the f- what? Oh, a classic headline. Fuck. The classic headline was me getting fucking kicked in the head. I'm gonna get- I'm gonna throw this guy. Can I throw him into the screen? Yeah, 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 they're dead. They're out. That's it. They're gone. Hey, Jester. How's it going today? It goes fine. I'm a bit tired, honestly. I woke up really early and didn't sleep very well, which is why the stream's kind of late. Ow. I did not evade that blow. Ah, I should have supered it. I'm gonna super it. Ah, oh, he just ran through. Well, he got he got fucked up anyway. About that dodge roll type B. Oh wow, that worked. No, the, oh, the pizza. He's got like no health. Get him all the way down. Oh, I tried to, <laughs> I tried to intercept his charge. I thought it'd be funny if I could intercept his charge, but no, it's a bad move. It's not the plan. Oh baby, time to the millisecond. I see timer brain activate. Even though I haven't, I haven't, when was the last time I sped around a new game? It was Eve, wasn't it? It wasn't that long ago. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, was, there was a recent-ish special request unlocked. What? Oh, okay, bye. There was a, a recent live-action movie, wasn't there? What's this request you're on about, mate? I need my papers back. Now hurry. Hmm. What's Turtle Lair? Oh, it's it's achievements. Power levels, points needed. I see every character has a separate power level, so you gotta play through the game fucking six times to unlock all of the moves. Finish level unharmed. The cheek of it all, dude, to have that be the very first level. The very first objective, rather. I think it tells you where they're found, how about that? This game has really nice pixel art. It's a very pretty game. Does IGT really affect my speed game choice? Uh, not necessarily, but a good one being baked in does make it very frictionless. I want- I'm in this corner, this is my corner, you get the fuck out of the screen. Okay, it says- it says go, but like, what if I don't go, you know? Like, what if I just don't do that? I'm going to continue juggling this until it makes me stop. Damn, it made me stop. What does this do? Oh shit! I'm- I'm going on a spree! Classic headlines. Bobbing and weaving through the shit. Garbage bag. I found Irma. You were, you were stuck in a door. <laughs> like, in the door. What, was it locked? <laughs> Oh, that didn't blow up as fast as I thought it would. Not having a high combo actually like does for you. Oh, I broke I broke the thing before realizing it was intended to help me defeat the enemies. No, oh, I want I'm continuing my juggle. You can't stop ah, oh, they'd stop me. I can't even take the pizza, I haven't taken any fucking damage. Well, you know, sometimes I don't know what I expected to happen there, but I was thinking maybe if I did a cool sliding maneuver, it wouldn't take place in that exact way. <laughs> but instead, exactly the thing that I was trying to evade. Foot icon! Fuck. Oh, that works too, actually. You can do a sliding move. Ex well, don't run into them trying to do the slide. Do I have to defeat them? I guess so. This is an entirely new game. Though very obviously in the vein of the classics. <laughs> the sliding maneuver. <laughs> Get a sliding type. Get a sliding tight maneuver. That's the way. That's the ticket. 
Oh, I don't get. Well, he got a slight. Well, you know, sometimes you just fucking uh, die. I bet you there's a secret in this hole. No, there was only pain in the hole instead. It didn't work out for me at all. Once again, I was too early. Can't hit me with that. That's the oldest trick in the book. I like the way this game feels. It's like nice and fast and stuff. What does this do? Oh, infinite ninja power. But gosh. So you, just, you can just use your supers. So, like, so you just win the next encounter because you can just use your supers like indefinitely. Go. It's always so demanding. It's like, go, go now. Go now. Where? Where are we going to? Oh, let's fucking go, they say. But they never say where we're going to. I'm gonna roll through that shit. Ah, I get... Oh, I can stock two now. Stock two bars? Don't mind if I do. Nah, man, I'm gonna iframe through that shit. Ah, oh, I didn't iframe through that, though. Fuck. Mm, fucked up. I rolled back in front of the shotgun. I'm not building any meter like this. These grenades hitboxes are massive, bro. Well, I win. I killed him. I killed them all. Someone unfamiliar with the 80s show or all the foot soldiers robots? I don't know. You're asking the wrong guy, man. I'm like a special request from Irma Langan. Why does it stay on the screen for such little time? Multiple diaries? There's multiple diaries. That's ridiculous. It needs a multiple diaries. Tell it tells you where they're found. Four, five, six, seven. Mutants over Broadway. <laughs> Location, Broadway. I would never have guessed. to finish the level unharmed again. I don't think it's an auto-scroll. I think it's just a level where the background moves. Like, like consider the, the nature of this. How does this meaningfully differ from... I'ma jump it. I jumped over it. I'm a god. I'm godlike. I'm so fresh. Oh, I'm fresh. I'm not fresh. That was unfresh. Dude, the, the fucking jump attack is really picky. That reminds me of Simpsons Arcade as well. Ow. <laughs> Challenges! You are bad! for a maneuver here. Perhaps not. Do 
Dude, the jump attack- wow, the jump attack input in this game is really persnickety. It says just square and X, but I have a really hard time getting it to activate consistently. Okay, I was already getting up. A conveniently timed pickup. Dude, I cannot get jump attacks to consistently trigger. What is wrong with this? That's the one part of old school beat'em ups you didn't need to copy. It sure, it sure does remind me of the Simpsons arcade in like a bad way. <laughs> I never liked how jump attacks were really persnickety in that game. It feels unnecessary. Because that game also has a thing where you can do like a rising jump attack by pressing like jump and attack at the same time. And it's also like extremely picky about the inputs being exactly simultaneous. Like there's no leniency on it at all. And it really sucks shit. Eh. We can combo a dive kick after it. I'm practicing. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. The idea. Okay. No, no, no. It's it's jump and then attack. Claims of simultaneous inputs are lies. It's a slide, not a simul. I've ascertained it. I've solved it. Ow. He, well, he just drove the car into me. That's not very nice now, is it? Where the fuck am I? <laughs> That's okay. That's not okay, though. I'm less okay with that. Ah! Yeah, okay, the, the key, the key, yeah, the key is definitely to piano the input. It's not to press, it's actually not to press both at the same time, at all. Okay. It, the, the input is tilde, not plus. Everything I said about the Simpsons arcade game is still true, though. That actually is a simultaneous input, and it is extremely picky about it. Simpsons arcade game is like my favorite beat em up, for what it's worth. That's why I draw constant comparisons to stuff. Because it's like it's this my favorite one, even though it's really basic. Like you can't really, you can't really like do combo in Simpsons arcade. Is he the redeem? No. Which means it is gone forever. I'm going to juggle this guy against the edge of the screen and I cannot be stopped. Ow. What's with you guys? No, you can't hit me with that kind of a maneuver. guy is a whip. That's fucked up, man. Off. Is it a mash? I think it's a mash. Hi 
Simpsons, not Scott Pilgrim. Yeah, Simpsons Arcade is my favorite Beavis. Scott, I like the Scott Pilgrim game a lot, but I think it has a fundamental first play problem, which is that it gets better on repeat playthroughs because your base movement speed at the start. Who the fuck is? I found, I found a frog. This is a turtle game, you imbecile. This, you, you've done it wrong. I was like, your base movement speed in Scotty Pilgrim fucking sucks on the first playthrough, and that really, like, that sucks. It sucks. It's bad. I don't like that. Fuck! I wish- I wish you started with, a uh, with- with better base movement speed in Scotty Pilgrim. Like, I'm okay with the, um, the- the RPG elements being a thing. But it takes a while for, like, Scott Pilgrim to really become fun, if that makes sense. Ah! Oh, bye. See you later. It doesn't take too long. It's not, like, an immeasurable problem, but I am not a fan of, uh, of the way it affects the movement speed in that game. Like, the movement speed is my biggest issue. You just, you, you, you cannot move very quickly at all in Scotty Pilgrim until a certain amount of levels under your belt. And it, it's, it's kind of a pain to get to that point, whereas Simpsons Arcade is good, clean, fun from start to finish, no strings attached, you know, because it's an arcade game. I died! Ah! Okay, well, fuck. I tried to super through it, but I wasn't fast enough. Oh, got him in one, baby. Okay, I got one of them, baby. <laughs> I got the juggles. I don't have the juggles anymore. I'm sorry. I thought I had the juggles, but the juggles really had me. Failed to complete the level without being grabbed. Fucking Jesus Christ. I found a disgusting bug. Ow. The monkeys are throwing shit. Do you mind, man? <laughs> I, I want to throw this guy. <laughs> They're gonna kill me. That man thought he was so clever with all that. Oh. I thought these guys were like the whip dudes, but they're not. Oh no, they are. They have that move too. Fucking monkeys, man. They just throw shit at me. Oh, there's a classic headline. I keep trying to double jump. There's no such thing in this game. What the hell are these jokers? Ground chuck and dirt bag. Get a super tight meat going on. Ow, I'm fucking burned. I fell in the hole! Fuck. Ah! Oh, come on now. Ah! It's okay, I've got three lives. Oh, I'm in the hole. <laughs> the hole has killed me. What the f- 
Mm, I don't know about that, dude. Zero out of ten. Do not talk to me. The attack, like, moved my hitbox far enough to get hit by the projectile. It's like, mm, I don't know about that, dude. In the hole. <laughs> Where did he team kill? Now I'm building meter. Cowabunga. Is that like a ranking, or does it just always say that? Crane's head is getting away, dudes. I, I get like three seconds to read that every time it pops up, and every time I don't quite get there. Yeah, I got 50 points for that. Like, experience points, I guess? Can you please find my diary? Please! King of the spill. King of the spill! You don't gotta say it after I- like, I'm the streamer here. Like, I- I'm the one who <laughs> announces. Why are we chasing a head around anyway? I'm sure someone who, like, actually knows the source material can provide some insight into why this is happening. Like, it's, it must be an important artifact somehow. Perhaps it grants immense powers. In the TMNT lore, I found a secret diary. Because the head seems pretty stressed out as well, you know? Like, it's not having a great time of it. Yeah. Oh, I tried to super. Everyone knows it's always the most fun to get on the train tracks. I just armored through it. I guess no, I guess projectiles just don't deal hit stuff. Evasive maneuvers. Technique. I thought... I don't know why. I thought I could pick up the toolbox. This was obviously foolish from the start. I'm gonna roll the fuck out of the way of that if you don't mind. If it's all the same to you, lad, I'm moving. So you know I think... I think... This is a small subtlety, but I think... I think it's right. I think the range from which the explosion can hurt enemies is bigger than the range from which it can hurt you. Because I'm pretty sure I was closer to that barrel than the enemy was to it, but it hit both of them, but not me. The action game cheats in favor of the player constantly. It is a stay. I'm not saying this is a bad thing, by the way. I'm just saying. I'm like, I'm on a bound to point these things out. Oh, f fuck. I'm, I'm, God, I'm doing something. Okay, so the goal of this stage must be to find the big rat who makes all the rules. That is a logical inference from what we have seen. I'm gonna super that shit. Oh, it spots out small dudes. No, the <laughs> sprite work in this game is really cute. really fun to be the kind of, like, fun and possibly a bit strenuous. I feel like it's got to be at least a bit fun. I found Genghis to be the guy who sits in the recording booth and makes all of the funny, like, hurt noises. He just goes, Hoo! Ah, yes, the pipes that exude steam. Nowadays, the kids don't have respect for the steam of old. Steam is just where you buy games now. Nobody fears steam anymore. <laughs> I 
don't know. What are you talking about, Punchy? No one knows. Fuck it, bit me. Look, corpses build me to two. Ah! <laughs> Boomer streamer confirmed. This is this is the stream that opened with me saying I have like near to no familiarity with with like the source. Yeah, it definitely hits enemies from further out than it hits you. That guy was definitely further away from it than I was. Like without question. I am the Rat King. Your trespassing. He is the Rat King. He makes all the rules. Oh, I didn't hit at all. Why am I trying to- I'm trying to perform rat activities. Are the rats foes? It must be. so happy to be here. No! Fuck! Okay, I got my damage that time. Meter. Ah! I tried to do super. I'm doing super. Leave me alone. This isn't befitting a king. I completed love without getting hurt more than two times from obstacles. Depends what you define as an obstacle, I guess, but I won't complain. The map loops in on itself. Do I have all the- I, I- there's no collectibles in stage three. Was, was April doing the meme point? She's a news reporter. She's pointing at the thing happening because there was a camera frame around the scene. She's got a microphone. The meme point? I will smash this wall. I didn't even- you didn't even really need to ask. Oh, failed to finish level without using super attacks, did I? Well, fuck you. <laughs> These challenges are super uncool. are before I start the level. Like, there's probably a way to check, but I'm, I don't care enough to check before I start the level. The hell is this? That's what you get. The... What the fuck? Rip me, dude.
prevents me from pausing your stuff. Yeah, but who's gonna do that on their first playthrough, you know? Did T Lopes do the soundtrack for this game by any chance? Because he's made Studioopolis again. This is Studioopolis zone again. Yeah, it's T Lopes. How did I fucking know? <laughs> Is it because it's the song again? I'm being mean. He's turning into a mean streamer. Oh, the ball, it hurts passively as it swings around. That wasn't really worth it, now was it? You've thrown a CRT at me? That's valuable. The melee players will cry. This is gonna get me a major promotion. Punk frogs. I, f I found Napoleon. I don't know who this is. Yeah, now that I've learned the secret to jump attacking. They could be gaming. Uh, Vernon! Just hiding in the popcorn machine. Fuck! I tried to dodge. It was not fast enough. Basic combo? Yeah, you just you press the attack button a bunch of times and that's it. There you go. That's your combo. The Dame of Games! Ow. Ooh, armor through that shit! Ooh, what a technique! What a move! Oh fuck! I'm in the stinky gas! I'm in the stinky gas! It fucking stank in here, bruh! No, I armor- you- you go through that shit! Well, it's like I get off me move- I'm also- I got the move too! It's invincible! Cancel and it's free! Free damage! Okay, I think I know this works really well against the bosses in this game, is that you do combo, they get knocked down, they wake up with something invincible, you do super on their wake up, you invincible through their wake up, and then you do damage. Another missing robot piece? What a shocker. Tubular. I've unlocked a spe- <laughs> It goes away so fast. You've got to find my VHS tapes. Do I now? Do I really?
running reptile. <laughs> Punchy, what, what? What did I do? Oh, well, that, then they've got spears. You could have seen this coming. Not me, that's for sure. Yeah, it just stabbed me. That's fucked up, man. Oh. Will that hit far enough? Uh, mostly. I'm discovering it's actually, like, good to hit corpses, because, you like, corpses build meter all the same. Lol. Ah, I got stabbed. I tried to super first. Didn't happen, though. Foot cruiser. The range of that is not as big as I think it is. That guy just fell off the edge. He's gone. He's donezo. He's out of there. Ah, he's also donezo. Fucking told it to him. Damn. This guy got, like, stuck. I feel bad for him. But not that bad. Oh, I'm off. I, I didn't do that. Apparently, when that guy fell off the cliff, that was it. It was over for him. He was donezo. I will have nothing to do with these two gentlemen wielding their sharp sticks around. Don't I? Okay, I didn't ask for a grab, but a grab I received anyway. Wee. So I was supposed to just hit it and get off. Like what? I found a pizza. Alright, these guys are annoying. You die now. Eh. Eh. <laughs> I killed someone by knocking the cone! Oh, what? I hit. Crazy. Fuck, they counter quickly. The rudeness of it is not something I abide by personally. Just press share to view the challenges? No, you have to, pr you have to pause the game. Complete the level without falling into a pit is the third challenge, and now that we know that, uh, it's a terrible thing for me to know. I should have just fallen off a cliff and not know. I did not ask for a fucking throw! How did it not get that guy? You kidding me? One guy moment. Ah, uh, got him, GG's. I'm gonna I'm gonna take this cone into the boss. It'll work great. See, I've got I've got a I now have a cone stocked. This will be the most important. I don't have meter stocked. Now I have meter stocked.
fuck? Why did you go that way? That is, I was not, I was not even holding a direction for that. He's dead. I have killed him. Hurting themselves when they hit the wall too. My horns. <laughs> Looks like another Completed the level without falling into a pit. Come on, let's go. I think they hurt. That. Oh, it's because he's hitting the cone. See, the cone technique was the key. It was always about the cone. I have completed Irma's special request. I don't know if it's speed strat, but it was it was working pretty well. Did I miss anything in that level? No, I got it all. I got it all. Pro gamer, got all the challenges, all the collectibles. I never need to play episode seven ever again for the rest of my life. Panic in the sky. It's over. It's a flying level. A flying level is fundamentally the same thing as a driving level, it's just the, f the floor looks different. Failed to finish level unharmed. RIP. Kind of boring in solo play. I, how, I mean, for one thing, I'm having a good enough time with it, but also, uh, how would multiplayer make this fundamentally that much different? <laughs> like, the corollary to that is that multiplayer would really spice this up, but like, you just have two dudes running around instead of one, right? Like, this is, like, odd to me, because it's like, where's where's my hitbox for this? I mean, I guess it's fine. I, I got away with it. But, the, like, the, the, the rockets were, like, flying side on, but, like, the, the gameplay is isometric. Well, not isometric. But, okay. Different kinds of, like, 2D going on. No, it is... So what do I... How do I describe this? Someone understands what I mean, but I'm expressing it badly. The rockets are flying across the screen as though it is a purely flat 2D plane, but the movement of the characters on the screen implies, like, depth. Which is making it very difficult for me to gauge the relative distance between the rockets and me. Does that explain my problem with that slightly better? I have killed everything. Like, is where I'm standing? Like, 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 is it the board? I don't know. Odd. Like, minor, but odd. Ow. Should have supered. Damn, 
I tried to super and didn't come out. My kingdom for an indicator for where that guy's gonna come out from? <laughs> Just me? Oh, I thought he wasn't gonna do it. He was gonna do it. Come here, you little shit. I killed him. Just mash him to death, it's fine. Is this a cuphead level now? No. No, still, still a beat him up. Like, fundamentally, it, the stage looking like it's in the air doesn't really change anything about how it plays. It's still a flat plane that you move around in. It is, it is nothing but an illusion. Pony Island doesn't sound like a real place. Come on, let's go. Plungers. I'm not saying the illusion isn't cool, you know, for the flying levels. I'm just saying that it doesn't fundamentally make the game play any differently. Like, that's fine, but people in chat seem to be like, oh, you know, this is, it's a, it's an auto-scrolling level, it's a flying level now, it doesn't, it does not actually. I got fucking hit by a plank of wood. Come in. Brit New York might sound like a fake name. No, that sounds like a real name because I've like, like, of course, you know, Americas love to do the, the new thing. But like, York is a, is a real place. That I am actually familiar with at that. Is that a battle toad? No. I don't know what it is, but it's not a battle toad. I'm going to keep pressing square until one of you gets hit. Nope. <laughs> Again, I'm going to advance forward and press attack until you get hit. And that is how this is going to go down. Came out. He didn't even know. He didn't even know. Oh fuck, he knew. That guy knew. That guy had the timing, he knew. That one was smart. He was pretty good. They jump out of it. Michelangelo is the least liked turtle? I don't know, do a character popularity poll or something to finally settle that question once and for all. All I know is that I wanted a character with, like, range. But I didn't want to pick Donatello. 
because he had pop a balloon. Okay, how? Start. Oh, I see. Just, just like the Simpsons arcade, every good beat em up has a balloon popping segment. It's true. Actually, no. That's not. You don't even pop the balloon in Simpsons Arcade. You like build one up and then use it to to like to fly. The least like turtle is Venus. That doesn't sound real. That's like some expanded universe shit. Y'all reading the fucking tie-in novels? The f I dislike this guy much. I hit him, but he not hit. He moved instead. <laughs> I'll read in the extended novel. I mean, there's, there's like someone in this chat room who understands like the specifics of, of TMNT lore. With extraordinary precision. Ow. Oh, he's off. I don't have any meter. I thought I had meter. I don't have meter. No! Ah! That motherfucker ate me! I'm dead! Yeah, this guy doesn't, like, play the game. I'm very surprised that I lost that exchange. I got him. Is it bad that you like the edgy turtle? No. I like do you think I'm really here to judge people based on their preference in ninja turtles? What's the status on the game? Socks or owns? I think it's pretty good so far. It's very colourful, it has nice animation, plays decently. Yes, I don't know enough about the subject matter to make a judgment. I almost exclusively consume Ninja Turtles. That's a really disgusting phrase. I exclusively, like, know Ninja Turtles through, like, the context of video games. Hot take on turtle preferences. My hot take is I don't want to know what your turtle preferences are. The less I know about chat's turtle preferences, the better. Keep that to yourself. Some things are not to be said at the dinner table. I'm going to juggle this idiot endlessly. Fuck, I wanted to get the- This guy thinks he's gonna run me over, thinks he's so clever. Ah, oh, he couldn't run over- he couldn't run over a fly! Because that's actually- that's actually really hard to do. I mean, on the one hand, hitting a fly with a car is both, like, the easiest thing in the world to do, because it happens all the time by accident, but, like, Try and hit a fly with a car on purpose, I can imagine it's probably pretty challenging, you know? Like if it's a specific fly. And you don't have the precision. So what are you supposed to do with that? That's very challenging, I would think. Got him. Oh, 
Oh. Fucking hell, I can't like get near them when they're like this. <laughs> Pizza toppings of choice, lots of meat. Don't even think of trying to steal my story. Meat of all kinds is the way forward. I will juggle these fools until the end of time. Not hit either of them. Damn, dude. Ah, I wanted to build my meter back. Should be doing supers more. You build meter like really fast in this game. It's like it's like not a resource to covet. Covet not thy meter, for it build mad fast, yo. I think that's like one of the the commandments. I went to Sunday school. Hi Fucking... Slash N slash Turing complete. Thanks for the 13 months. That's very nice of you. It's kind of hard to sorry. It's like kind of hard to look at chat while I'm playing this game. As it transpires, it's a uh, it's, it's slightly difficult to play fast moving action game and observe the chatting room. I understand if chat feels a bit put out this stream. I will never move on until I'm done juggling this motherfucker. No! Just put chat on a text to speech. Well, like, I dodged that. I disagree. Like, uh, like, uh, like the Japanese streamers do. That's really popular in Japanese streams, is to have the chat be on text-to-speech. teaches me extreme chaos. Yeah, no, it only, it only works up to, like, a certain size of stream, and I think I'm past it. I don't have any meter. Why? Okay.
Do you, like, lose Mita when you get hit or something? Turn around and face the fucking guy! Ah, he went in though. Sliding tackle. So clear to me now. The turtles are my friends. This is a system crash. Looks like another victory for the forces of good. You lose me if you get hit and it's not a full bar. I see. That lines up with my experience. The best turtle, according to chat, was Donatello. But that's not who I'm playing as. Tonight, he dines on turtle soup. Chad, have you ever eaten a turtle? Change character then? No. I'd have to restart the whole campaign. No, but you have eaten crocodile. Back at you, creeps. The studio was trying to get me to eat uh, alligator once when AGDQ was in um. What's your face? The place. It's, it's not been in that many places, and yet I struggle to remember precisely. <laughs> Claudia, yes. That's exactly it. They have guns! Jump! I did. Nope. Not good enough. You didn't jump the good enough. The jump was the wrong kind of jump. I can get away with that, but I really can't. Am I running at GDQ? No. That is a question that can be answered by control Fing the schedule. Now you- oh wow, you don't even lose like a portion of your meter if you get hit, you lose all of it. I feel like Mita builds pretty fast in this game. Then again, I have also been repeatedly engaging in the fine art of corpse juggling. What the fuck? That wasn't very nice, now was it? Dude, this guy stabbed me with a sword. That's fucked up. You could really hurt someone with that. Absolutely not. Oh 
my I can stock three supers now. I can trigger a powerful wait, that means wait, can I not No, I can do my regular super, it's on a different button. Because I would like to now. found Dask. That sounds like a fake person as well. Fucking goddamn. All right, fine. We'll activate radical mode. I don't know what this does. Uh, it seems like... Uh, I don't know. I honestly, I, I could not tell you what, I could not tell you what Radical Mode was actually doing. Now see, I don't think this guy is real either, this guy also seems like a fake character, but on the other hand, he looks like something that could come out of Ninja Turtles. This guy's really going to insist on hanging around at the screen edge where the enemies are spawning, huh? That's really the thing that's happening here. They're, like, stacking on top of each other. But it's okay, I'm, I'm still... I win the game with no... I, <laughs> I have one hit remaining, it's okay though. It's fine. Gamer. We must go underground. Play stupid. Don't play smart. Space Triceratops Evil Empire fighting with elves. That sounds great. It won't fly. I can get behind that kind of a beat. Rarely do I ever actually intend to throw someone, and yet a throw is definitely what occurs. Lots of small enemies is very good for building shit tons of meter really fast. Or that. <laughs> Dude, fuck. And suddenly I have three meter. One hit. Fucker. Oh. No, 
Can I, like, move away from here, please? If you wish to move into the whirring blades of death, that is your own choice. But I do not- I do not exist to affirm these activities. in the box, man. It's okay, I will hide in the secret area. Okay, that hit nothing. I'm some way in and I still don't really have any grasp for that. The range of the special eludes me to this very day. Fire. Juggling this guy for meter. It's working. The plan is working. It was a short range hop. They short hopped it. I'm very surprised I got away with that. Damn, that actually spent my meter. So I must get it back by juggling this idiot. <laughs> Oh fuck, I dropped it. I dropped the juggle. It's over for me. I find the slide move is the best at disabling these, although I couldn't tell you why. It just seems like it works the best. Fly Entist. Oh fuck, that means... No, dude, the flying enemy is always the worst one. Oh, okay. Jesus fucking Christ.
feel like I killed him pretty fast. Take his gun? I'm a gun turtle. This this should be a ninja turtle that uses a gun. The old dome has seen better days. Did everyone just like teleport outside or something? I've completed the punk frog's special request. I did it. I completed the punk frog request. Where are the punk frogs again? I've lost track of the punk frogs. I did it. I think I've missed one of his VHS tapes. Oops. It's the online function. I refuse to play the game online. I will never be online. It just isn't happening. Oh no, the last one's apparently in 13, which I think is the level I'm about to play. Oh, no, sorry, I hit the wrong button. I, I, pressed, I did Japan Brain from him and I hit circle. Redux. <laughs> I hit one dude, immediately leveled up. Oh, he punched me right in the face. Socked it to me. Fuck! I could really do without enemies just storming in at the screen edges like that. Like, it's a good thing this game's kind of easy or that would really get on my tits. There it is, found it. Trying to steal my story. I dropped. up with a special kind of maneuver. Nope, guy charged him from the edge of the screen completely unpredictably. Okay. I found Kala. That is an elf! You guys weren't kidding about the elf thing. That? No, not even close, dude. I don't know about those grenades, man. So was the last guy found? I didn't... Where were, other guy? I recall nothing of the sort. Why would we kid about TM and Tilo? Because honestly you could tell me anything and I'd believe it.
I don't know why it tracked to the guy who just ran past me. The direction I've I've I'm like nearing the end of this game, I think, and I've still not really ascertained how the dash attack, like the move it does out of dodge roll. I don't really get how that works. It seems to just lock on, but the way it locks on, it just like has a mind of its own. It just goes wherever the fuck. Trag. What is this? What is he doing? massive hitbox during charge attacks is fucking annoying. It's okay. It's okay. So, so, so far my feelings about this game are, it's a good thing it's easier or it'd be kind of annoying. tell you what I got hit by in the corner there. Dude, fucking hell. Just stand up. Hello, where's Super? That was such a bad Super as well. It took me ages to get it out. When it finally happened, it was unsatisfying. Yeah, the attention calls are shit. I don't like that's it. There's, there's a lot going on and it doesn't do very much to make it known that a lot's going on. Like, look at how slight and how fast the queue is on these, like, dudes firing beams in the background. It's super fast, and that didn't hit me at all, and you will never convince me it did. The attention calls are bad, and the hitboxes are ginormous. So, I don't know where I can stand. Not in the hole, that's for sure. Pausing the game and shaking my head at that, because, like, no. No. Not even close, dude. Not even- like, that actually vacuumed me in. After- after hitting me. That's fucking lame, bro. Go back and do that again. Yeah, the rock dudes just like start dashing in from the- especially when they just charge in from the screen edge and it's like, oh, I guess I'm supposed to just know where they come out from. 
Okay, that didn't work. The only way I knew- okay, the reason I knew that to throw the, the enemies at the screen for that is that that's a thing you also have to do in Turtles in Time. But I'm not- I don't think if you- if, if you haven't played that game, I'm not sure it was obvious to do that. Like, I knew that because I've played a different game. But nothing else in the game makes you do that. It's kind of like- I remember that because I remember it throwing me off in Turtles in Time as well. So how is this game? Mama. I have completed Vernon's special request. It's about time. My it's a very pretty game. It's got very nice sprite work. And the soundtrack's quite good as well. But as, as it rolls on, it's, Lost arch enemies. it's a little shaky on the, like, actual solid action game front. It's not terrible, though. It, the, main, the main thing keeping it from being frustrating is just that it's quite easy. Which is fine. I mean, I prefer easy to, like, hard. Hurt more than one times from obstacles. I disagree. I love English. It's my favorite language. Master, thanks for the 12 months prime game. What have I playing? I'm playing on the normal difficulty. I think the game calls it okay. Oh, just, just a whole pizza? I do like the addition of a dodge roll. Like, that was always what like kind of bugged me about uh, Fight and Rage specifically, is that there was no particularly like good dodge maneuver. I don't know. See, I I find myself wondering like lately, do I even like this genre, like belt scrollers in particular? The belt scroller, as it is called in Japan, because I remember not being particularly impressed with Streets of Rage Four either. And everyone seemed to really love that game, and I was just like, eh. Ouch. Like, I think I like this genre. I like The Simpsons Arcade. But I, I definitely was sticking out a hitbox there. Hiya. All of you go away. You're messing with my mojo. So I needed to itch my nose there real fast. What the fuck? Why? Explain yourself.
genre, the genre, like specific games of the genre. I mean, what's the difference? Point is, is that I, when I think of a beat em up, I don't think, ah, oh, you know, I don't like this at all. I would never enjoy this. Like, I do, I, I've played games in this genre that I've liked. Oh, here comes Mr. Charging, dude. I want to touch it. I don't know what I was expecting. Yeah, I haven't liked any of the critical darlings in this genre for like a while. To be clear, like I don't hate this, but as I, as I'm like as as the game is rolling on, I think I think my my end thoughts on this one are coming out too. Yeah, it's all right. Honk. He wakes up with super, and then gets burned immediately once the invulnerability wears off. Ooh, the idol. You gotta get the idol. Oh, it made a boulder roll across. That's pretty funny. Actually, like I liked Scott. Pil I liked the Scott Pilgrim game as well. Like that's I rebought that, played it again, and still enjoyed it. But again, I like I explained the fact that I have a sort of I have issues with Scott Pilgrim, which is namely that the RPG elements like fuck up the pacing because it's more fun on your second playthrough. Because your, your movement speed at the start of the game is really fucking bad, and that really sucks. Okay. Don't try to jump over the projectile. It is not allowed. The space elf is simply called Zack. That was not the move I actually wanted. <laughs> no, I can do that too. What? Dude, Jesus Christ. I think Slash was recently added to Smite. Is he a god now? Is that what that means? And the window of attack there is so brief. Smite really lost the whole gods vibe. But, like, it's in the name, right? Like... Yeah, I'm thinking about the fact that, like, I'm playing this game and my, my feelings are, like, kind of wavering between it's alright and it's alright. <laughs> Different intonation. Uh, Fight and Rage, which I played once, I think, and also ended up being like, it's alright. It's, like, very complicated and, like, there's a lot to learn in that game. But I still recall just thinking, it's all right. We need to find our crystal shards, you dig? And Streets of Rage 4, which I found flat out kind of boring, if I'm being honest. I don't, I don't really vibe with Streets of Rage's super slow as fuck movement speed. I've never liked that about that franchise. Any games that are all left? Yes, Disco Elysium. But that is neither here nor there. Oh, there's two of them now. That's crazy. Okay. You see how I like thought it was gonna land on me, so I tried to dodge, but instead I dodged into it, because you can't really react, because it appears and then goes in like a split fucking second. That's the kind of thing I'm saying where I'm saying the uh, the 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 call the 
the attention calls in this game are bad. <laughs> they are bad. That needs more warning. I, I will not mince words. That's bad. That needs more work. That go that go that goes back in the oven. That fucking guy jumped off the screen. That's also very much like go back in the oven. Oh, you know, he's jumped. I'll go in for a counter. He's off the corner of the screen. He has moved to a position where I cannot strike him because camera. It's fucking raw! As a, as a certain chef would put it. Bikes. Okay, don't stand. Don't touch the hot stove, shithead. Why? I, I don't get why he dodged backwards. I didn't. Okay, no, I'm pausing the game and I'm, I'm pausing the game to complain about something again. I held forward the entire time and he dodged backwards. I don't know why that happens. Like, sometimes the game just decides that, like, what my dodge direction should be for me. Hello? Oh, okay. about that theory. theory. It's important, man. Action games benefit from this degree of thought. It's a very subtle genre, which might explain why I can tolerate very few games in it, apparently. Ah, the bomb! Damn. That was, like, mostly what I wanted to do that time. That guy's bullet hit me from behind. <laughs> That guy's bullet hit me while I was standing behind him. Happy Father's Day. Not a father. How close is the end? I imagine it has to be fairly close. I don't think this game is longer than like a couple hours. hurt by this? Yes. I, know, I just needed to know. Like, I know they've done a, a subtle thing there where the, the range for the explosion to hurt you is significantly 
uh, wider than it is for the... Ex yeah. The explosions hit enemies easier than they hit you. Okay, there we go. That was the thing I was going at. Like, trying to, like, compose a thought in your head. And remember the order in which you spoke the words is a difficulty of mine. Do you understand what I'm trying to, sell, to tell you here? Does it make sense? Prang. Damn, I want a super cancel. Dang. There we go. That's how we get that super cancel. So he tries to hit me with big foot, but I, I armor through that shit. Oh no! He does Lariat! Oh, I was hoping that would do damage. It doesn't. Oh, that's the part that you actually hit. I don't know why that stopped working. It just does after a certain number of hits, I guess. The key is, like, do a combo and then, like, immediately dodge your super. Like, every time on bosses. It's always that kind of pattern. My webcam is obscuring the right side of the screen. Yeah, I like the idea. Like, enemies dimming when you defeat them is also, like... Oh, it's Shredder. Here he is. We found him. I think there was... There's some tell for that in the Simpsons Arcade that I can think of. Oh. What? <laughs> what was that floaty move? That didn't look cool at all. That was super lame. Oh, I dodged into the pizza. I was kind of hoping to, like, let that sit for a bit. Fuck, that time I got hit for doing super. What the fuck? Why did I slide towards him like that? <laughs> that floaty kick looks terrible! That has such weird energy about it. But it, like... He, he floats in like that, I don't know. Is that ready for sudden Wu-Tang Clang? That was over so fast, I don't think I passed it. The Statue of Liberty became cool. Put on the cool glasses. I've completed the request from Dimension X. You got all the shards way out. What's the mean? Okay, hang on. Sorry. I'm about to do a thing here. What's the meaning of the points at this stage when I've already got maximum level? You don't, you don't even need, like, to complete all of this to, to get Mac, like, this is it. This is the whole thing. Like, it's done. You get, you get like, some extra health. You can stock multiple supers. Uh, you start the stage with more lives, which honestly has not been much. I, like, I haven't died more than once in the level, and even then, and, like, only once. Sometimes. It's like a pretty easy video game so far. Statue of Tyranny. Failed to finish the level on- Is that really the kind of thing you need to show the player on their first play of the stage every fucking time? Come on, man! Oh shit. I dashed. 
and hit attack out of the dash, whereupon the dash attack auto-corrected to the middle of the stage, getting me instantly killed. Thank you. Very cool feature. The dash attack auto-corrects to enemies, which means sometimes it picks an enemy completely unpredictably. You also can't dodge up and down, which I kind of wish you could. I'll be fine if I stand here. So like don't don't do the fucking dash attack apparently. Failed to finish level without using super attacks. Oops. <laughs> Fuck okay, thanks. <laughs> Why does it show me that? I don't care, go away. Just, just trying to make me feel bad about using the mechanics? Why? <laughs> What's your fucking deal, bro? Also, that counts as a distinct level, apparently. I don't know, is it over? Okay, step one. Figure out how to even damage the fucking guy. like an avoid damage kind of deal until like he's vulnerable really it seems that way well he's having a great time over there and then he does big thing and he becomes weak and then I accidentally go through him while trying to do a comp <laughs> fucking Jesus Christ Got slide by accident. Yep, this uh, this appears to be a waiting fight. I'm brimming. the whole game without one of these and then it's the last boss. Nope, wrong timing for that, apparently. Fuck. Oh, something has changed. Whatever it was. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, they fired a ball at me, I see. I mean, I didn't see at all. That was the problem. Okay, see, now I can, like, play the game. This is active. I have to, like, do something. Oh, no, we're we back to waiting now. Okay, we're back to waiting, I think. Ouch. 
vulnerability. He has to go through like a whole cycle of his move. Why was there only one phase where I had to actually participate in the video game? Is it random? I swear if it's random, have fucking fun, guys. Whee! <laughs> My revenge? Impossible. That was dreadful. Why would... <laughs> Please don't, okay, please don't have that be the final boss. Please no. <laughs> Come on, dude, you gotta. Looks like another... <laughs> please don't have that be your last boss. Please don't do that to me. Come on. Come on, like you got, you know better, surely. Do you know better? They don't know better. They don't know better, do they? No, they don't. Okay. <laughs> That's embarrassing! This game has an 86 on Metacritic. Are you fucking joking? Last boss like that? It's like what the fuck? The wait, the waiting around. <laughs> why would why? Like it's not just that the boss itself is like a wait to do the thing phase, right? Like I, I'm not a fan of that kind of boss design in general. Like whatever, but it's the, it, that's what they chose to end the game on is what gets me. Like that was your pulse pounding finale. That's what you went with. That was what you went with to finish the game. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> Why is that? Why is that? The gameplay style you went with for the <laughs> That's killing me, dude. I'm not gonna be able to get over that. That was so boring. It's like, I'm waiting. I'm jumping over the projectiles. It's like, once I figured out the pattern, it wasn't very hard. It didn't take me that long. There's only like two attacks. It's like I'm laughing about this because like I can't imagine how that comes to be. It's like what? It's like the only boss of that type in the game as well. Like this boss, this, this game was actually very light on bosses where you have to wait to like do a thing. But then the last one. <laughs> The last one is like that. I'm like, fuck. We almost had a whole game without a waiting boss, and then it's the last one. <laughs> this is this is not the reaction you want a person to have. This is not the reaction. Oh no, dude. <laughs> oh no. That's so fucking funny. You know, the the, ran, the the one hit KO move was on the previous fight where the, where the dash attack auto corrected into it. Very cool, by the way. I don't think the dodge attack needs to auto correct to enemies. That shit's really annoying. Particularly because I I can't like predict which enemy it's gonna lock on into. That's not copium, dude. I'm I'm huffing the copium mad hard right now. <laughs> 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 you okay? Sorry, I'm just like that. That's like that's like that's put me into a state of hysterics. That that's put me into a state of hysterics. That that final that final boss. <laughs> Joy watching me go from game pretty good to game trash. I wouldn't say game trash. That final boss definitely took the wind out of my fucking sails, though. Game still okay. Yeah, I, I did go from game pretty good to eh, game's okay. Over the course of like the back half, where I was like eh. 
These, these, these warning cues are not sufficient. Game fine. I don't know. This, this is a, this is another case of me. I think just like I don't I don't understand what I don't understand what people see in this genre. Sometimes, sometimes I, don't, I sometimes I feel like I operate on a di on a different wavelength to everyone else. Because like I, I had the same rate. Streets of Rage Four also reviewed. It was T Lopes. I'm godlike. It was T Lopes doing that. I'm godlike. He composed Studioopolis again for the third time. Round of applause. That's very mean, but I did it anyway. Punchy gets sidetracked. Yeah, no, I, my, my train of thought got completely interrupted by the fact that I was like, is this T-Lopes? Because this is, this is Studioopolis again. This is the same song. It's not the same song, but like, I'm making a joke about the fact he has like, this is the same song. You know what I mean? I'm being, I'm being kind of a pain in the ass. Right, what was I saying? Game went from like game pretty good to like game okay over the back half as as like the the, the the attention calls got more necessary, as stages got more complex and they just weren't there. <laughs> they weren't there. That was NDA. Will works on the game and is like publicly his involvement has been publicly known for ages. But no okay, the thought I found it. I found the, the thought I was back on. Streets of Rage 4 also, I remember, reviewed extraordinarily well, and I also found myself just completely unimpressed by it. I remember thinking Streets of Rage 4 was quite boring, actually. And I'm having a similar... I think I like this game a bit more than Streets of Rage 4, regardless, just because you can move. I've never liked Streets of Rage's very slow movement speed. This is a lot of people working on this game. You know, I'd, nevertheless, I'd heard good things about this one. It's reviewed extremely well, so I was like, you know, I'll, I'll play the beat em up, and maybe I'd enjoy it. But, nah, I don't know. This is, this, is, this is another one of those things where apparently I'm just really hard to impress on this genre. Seeing the influx industry as River City goes. Dude, okay, to, to put it in perspective, right, River City Girls seem to rest in a position of people where they go, like, this is pretty good. Uh, River City Girls for me was like so annoying, I neglected to finish it and refunded it. I found River City Girls incredibly irritating. That game has like six functions bound to the X button for some reason. All of the shoulder buttons are unused. Every time you like try and jab someone, you end up accidentally picking up an item or a corpse or fucking anything. All of the voice acting in that game is terrible. I hate every word that comes out of the mouth. It's not funny because WayForward are not good writers. That's also very mean, but I'm going for it anyway. Those people have no sense of comedic timing. This is the mean stream. This is this is me. I'm just going to vent about stuff. So I, I did not care for <laughs> River City Girls at all. Oh, it was fucking atrocious. It was really annoying. Hey, Kick Slam. How am I doing? Well, I finished the TMNT game and had a hysterical fit over the, the severe lack of energy of the final boss. So I'm, I'm like, I'm having a minor meltdown about it. <laughs> Thank you for playing. <laughs> He said thank you, at least. Makes me feel bad after being mean. Is this game at least overall fun? It's okay. I would give this, like... I don't know. I've unlocked Casey Jones. I I don't know. I'd like, uh, it was like... Six, seven, something like that. It's alright. It's okay. It's playable. I think this game's biggest ass, like biggest asset, is that it it, yeah, it has very nice sprite work. It's a very colorful game. But that's basically the game. What's arcade mode? The player's craving a harder challenge. Limited lives continues and no safe progression. This is the classic arcade. So it's like okay, it's stage rush. But that's that's more or less the game. That's the whole of the game. Complete the arcade mode in multiplayer. 
Master of one quarter. This is going to end up being like Fight and Rage, where I finish one playthrough and then never touch it again. I think is what's going to happen with this. Like, continue? Does that just... You don't want to give me a tutorial. Oh, so you, you can you can change character in the middle of the playthrough. Well, what are we waiting for? So neon white definitely better, yeah. Yes. If we if we must compare, that is what we shall say. Character on the map screen, yeah. I I yeah, that makes sense. Be weird if you couldn't, I suppose. Not that I can currently figure out how. Let's play a game with me here. How? What button do you press to change the character? Start? No. Share? No. Touchpad? No. R1? No. L1? That brings up the online menu. These are all people playing on Epic Games. I'm not, so that's interesting. Uh, L2? No. Party up? Triangle? No. That's that's net play again. Circle? Do I want to leave the world map? Yes, I guess. Is circle the way to do it? Circle is the way. Okay, you have to back out of the menu. Well, what are we waiting for? I rather, I rather feel like that shouldn't be something I have to guess. <laughs> That's me being very nitpicky. But I'm the, nit, pick these nits I fucking shall. Me rather thinks that sh like it's like what button do I need to press to change the character? Select your hero. You can play this game in six-player co-op if you can find five people who will tolerate people like me. That'll never happen. Nick's already picked. Nick's. What about Square for Total Lair? Total Lair only shows you like the achievement list, and then your power levels, and then your like objectives. It's, it, this does not let you change character. Put it that way. Like, that's the log- no, that's a logical thought, Prowga, that, like, Turtle Lair would be the place you would change characters. Wrong, though. That's- that's an intuitive and logical thought to have. Wrong, though. Select your hero. Meh! The game has been closed. I've closed the game. Yeah, on that note, uh, I think that will be it for me. I know this, make, this makes this a very short stream. But uh, honestly, I, I think I'm good on that the front of that game. I'm good, pal. And it's kind of late. I started later than usual. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed watching me whinge myself inside out, uh, follow me on Twitch. Now you can do things. Then you, you watch another time. You know, brain is, like, not working right now. It's too fucking late. I was tired when I started, which probably doesn't help. There's so a Discord, Twitter, etc., etc., social media stuff. You know how it is. Some of you don't know how it is. I don't know. The only thing I want out of, uh, out of... The Shredder's Revenge video game is a sprite rip. <laughs> I think that is... I need a sprite rip, and then I'm, like, content. Those are very nice animations. But other than that, meh, I'm, I'm okay with, like, playing it through once and then not thinking about it ever again. Is there anyone streaming to host? Let's see... Send you guys over to. I'm gonna send you guys over to No Good Citizen. They're practicing their speedrun of Mission Impossible for the GDQ Juneteenth celebration, which is a thing that he is in. I think he will be happy if I host him, so I'm going to do that. Have a good night, folks. I'm gonna go like make myself tea and go to bed probably. Like after I'm not like straight to bed.
Or whatever. Bye.